Behold the intimidating sight of Gunther. The ring general is ready to come out here and do what he does best inside the ring. The following contest is scheduled for one fall, making his way to the ring, representing Imperium from Vienna, Austria, weighing in at 297 pounds. Good Look at the pure determination on his face. It's determination and confidence, Cole, because Gunther knows exactly how good he is. Gunther knows he is on another level. It seems like Gunther is rarely in a good mood. I mean, does it hurt to smile? That's not necessarily true. Gunther smiles on the inside when he fillets an opponent's chest with his chops. Gunther is so unflinching, as if nothing phases him. The man's impervious to distraction because he's constantly focused on the task at hand. Yeah, it's like watching a machine. Here comes the Tower of Power. Dijak. And his opponent, from Worcester, Massachusetts, weighing in at 270 pounds. Dijak! Dijak's a monster, a mercenary, ready to decimate any competitor. I would limit Dijak's destruction to who's in front of him. He's out here taking people out from all angles. Yeah, Dijak's throwing bullseyes on anybody he chooses. I personally hope the next target's on you, Saxton. Underneath the scowling face and immense stature, Dijak has an incredible intellect. It's also what makes him so dangerous. The anger that fuels him is compounded by his in-ring IQ. Ladies and gentlemen, feast your eyes on the six foot seven, 270 pound tower of power known as Dijak. Take notice of a man with intense discipline and even more intense physicality. Yes, Dijak is certainly impressive. There's no telling how Dijak is going to obtain a victory in this one, but we know that's what he's come here for. Get ready for an eyeful. And the stoic figure fixed on him from across the ring is a straight up cyborg. The ring general hits you so hard, your body suffers blunt force trauma. Gunther is a commanding competitor who will do whatever it takes to demonstrate that he is the supreme being inside the ring. Double underhook suplex. He drop. Gunther has flight in mind. And his eyes are piercing through the opposition now. From the top, missile drop kick. Shoulders down. Oh my, how in the world did he kick out of that? Not even a near fall there. Stops the attack with a hit to the gut. Just carrying the opposition anywhere they want. He decides. Sheets. I honestly can't believe we just saw a human being tossed like that. Point of the elbow, nailed it. Quick thinking pays off. Every maneuver being returned with counterfire. Close line. Oh man, he is fired up now. I thought we saw this reach the boiling point already. <laughs> Boy, was that wrong. Well, that shouldn't be a new feeling for you, Saxton. You should try being right once in a while. It feels good. Bam! Down he goes. He's absorbed some damage already. Yeah, watching Gunther aggressively work the opposition. Discus Larian. He's going for it all. Perched up top. Drop. 
Hits him with the counter. Up across the shoulders. Boom! Feast your eyes. Dijak is just about to finish this. take to keep this guy down. Gunther able to steer clear. Gunther gets stymied. Gunther quick to the counter. Out of the ring. What's his plan here? He moved, but can he capitalize? A back suplex. Measured stomp right to the gut. Followed up by another in the chest. Ooh. Evades the attack. Gunter from behind. Looking to cinch it in. This one may be over. Good night. This won't win the match, but it's doing a lot of damage in the process. Whoa, this is surprising, Byron. Yeah, I'm not really sure why he would let him out right there. Brought back into the ring from the floor now. Top rope, here we go! From the top! Elbow drop! Good lord! Will it be? I think so! expect anything less from the ring general once again asserting his superiority